I want to make a couple of quick comments about the grow watt wiring compartment. Now the unit seems to be stylish and it's compact, appears to be well made, but I think they really fell short in this wiring compartment. And, and one thing, it's just too compact. It's uh, difficult to get your hands in to the back. I don't have particularly large hands, but I can't get my hands or my little short fingers very well to these back terminals to get the wire up in there. I mean, I got them up in there, but it took some effort to do it. If this box had been about two inches lower, wider, then there'd have been plenty of room. Another thing is um, these cables here, which connect to the PC boards. One's the communication board, and one is the uh, parallel operation board. The cables are pretty short. They're coming out from up in here and my output 240 volt wires that I put in here are hard up on these wires because they're just too short, they're in the way. I should have made those a little bit longer. And this, again, if this compartment was about two inches deeper, you wouldn't have as much, uh, it wouldn't be as close between that lug and the EMT. Now I'm gonna tape it with some red phasing tape, but still, I should have thought that a little better. Now I know we're only talking, we're talking about less than 60 volts, but it's still gonna be greater than 50 volts. Uh, and 50 volts is, a, is one of the thresholds for some of the classifications for wiring. But they could have done a better job if they'd have just deepened this box by about two inches. Uh, just a note. A little bit more, I guess, to put the DC wire on. I don't have my phasing tape with me, my red, so I'm gonna wait on that. And then the PV wire will come from here into this disconnect for the PV. All right, just a general observation.